just upgraded to my sixes and I love them, got a swivel thumb. And then I also upgraded my thinning shears or texturizing shears. I love it, I'm so excited. Vanika is the best, I will always buy their shears, 100%. Hi there everyone, my name is Larissa Camp and I'm here in Atlanta, Georgia, currently sitting in the office of Benika Shears with Bonnie and Jean McGowan. And the reason I'm on this video for today is that I would like to kind of share with you some of the things that I've experienced while being here in Atlanta and beginning out as a hairstylist. My story began in St. Louis, Missouri, where I was involved in a situation, uh, including domestic violence and turned out pretty tragic, not for what I thought it would be, and ended up having to have a partial amputation to my right hand. And unsure of where to go with that, I really prayed about how to live my life, how to move on for the future, and I realized that I still had the skills and abilities in me to become a hairstylist. So after much, much prayer, I decided that I would enroll at Empire Beauty College here in Atlanta. And I wasn't really sure about what I could do with that. I just knew that that's something that I really wanted to achieve. And I saw the new pairs of shears that we would be using and somewhat felt kind of intimidated. So one day I went to class and I saw Miss Bonnie McGowan um, giving a demonstration on the shears that they offered with the company of Benika Shears. And something prompted me to go over and talk to her about what they could do possibly to help me out in the area. And we discussed several options and lo and behold, we came out with a customized shear that I would be able to use for myself, um, to use with my right hand, with parts of the fingers that are amputated. And I can definitely say that since then it's been a blessing, a total work of wonder, uh, definitely godsend, and most importantly, it helped me to achieve something that I really wanted to do as far as being a stylist, but also blessed me to be able to still share my story with other people and to help facilitate uh, measures in that, in that area for my journey. And I've been ever so grateful. And for that, I know that it was perfect timing and divine alignment that led Benika Shears into my life. And I'm so thankful because now I can continue on that journey and I know that whatever needs or whatever thing, whatever possibilities or anything that you could ever think of or imagine that you want to achieve, it can be created. So for that, I do want to definitely thank Bonnie and Jean McGowan with Benika Shears and most importantly, thank God for sending them into my life to be a blessing, to help me to move further in this journey. And I hope that you consider and also Refer other people too, because you just never know who you can help by taking one step of faith, not being afraid to move forward. Thank you. It's a really good parting comb. It's also metal. Um, it's really smooth on the hair. It doesn't leave any tension or friction when you comb through your hair. It also has a parting comb on the side. That's really good. It's a part here. Section it off better. Everybody, I'm Yancey Edwards, celebrity hairstylist on the View on ABC. Um, I do everybody say from Raven to Whoopi to even a guest. I've even touched the president. Um, you know, given I want to just give you a little bit of some inspiration. You know, a little bit about myself. You know, a lot of a lot of times when when hard times came my way, you know, I didn't really have much to really look forward to. So I found myself in a, in a magical world of hair. Hair really saved my life. Because without hair, I wouldn't even have my high school diploma. I needed to go to hair school. You know, so, and I was 27 years old, so it's never too late to get yourself going. You know, I found a wonderful company like Bonica Shears, who, are, who works hand in hand with the stylist. And sometimes when, when money is hard and stuff like that, I was able to afford me a great pair of shears. There wasn't like that top of the line shears, but it was a great shear. So that was one thing. So you know what, even though sometimes you say, okay, I can't afford something, put a little stuff on the side and watch that one shear help you make two shears, help you make three shears. Now I have most of the collection. So you know what, 
keep on fighting and keep working hard. You know, and I, I can't wait to see you at the top. And we're gonna see you up on Nika's shears. Bye bye. The shears that I have, these little fireflies right here, I, I can't tell you how much I paid for them because I, I don't remember. Whatever they were, they were worth it. Uh, they probably bring me $100,000 a year right now. Is that the Mizutani? One more time. Mizutani? No, these are uh, Manika. Fireflies. The Fireflies, my favorite shears in the whole wide world. <laughs> I'm a professional hairstylist and it's just always been a pleasure to see the Manika Shear Company here and to know that they have great quality products and the companies that are here now they sell a lot of junk and it's sad to see that but it's always a blessing to see her here. I know that they're going to have top quality shears in stock all the time. Shop please! Okay, you're on. I've had hair in 35 years, and these are the most favorite scissors I've ever used. Show us what you got. The Panika Rose, okay. So tell me what you think of those shears. I actually love the rose shears. I have one that have all of, just about all of the the shears as long as I've been a stylist for 23 years coming up in October. I've always just used uh, Manika shears and the new rose shears, they feel very light, you know, it's easy to just kind of glide through the hair with ease. I love that, um, you know, when I grab the hair, one thing about the shears, our shears are sharp, so you just have to be careful, but I love that I'm able to just kind of glide through the hair, and when I want to just go and notch the hair, it's very light. I love it. It's just like a work of art. <laughs> Bonica shears, you know, I've been using Bonica shears since 1997. So that's one, two, I can't even count. Okay, forget about it. But anyway, we're gonna talk about some great shears, shears that I love to use. Um, we're gonna start with some curved shears. Why well, I like curved shears? I like giving texture to hair. Cause no one likes flat bar hair, right? No. Can we get a Can we get a curved shear? <laughs> Let's see, these, 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 are the, these are the curves here. You see that? And they're gonna great, the great things. I just take the finger um, guards out yeah. because my fingers are kind of big. So the great, the great, the great thing that I love about um, curve shears is when you're gonna get texture in the hair and you're gonna you're gonna cut in, and with the curve, it's gonna give you all types of texture in and out the hair. And also, it's a great, a great way to put texture, like to do like slide cutting and stuff like that's very sharp and it's very sturdy. So it gives you like nice bangs and stuff like that, and the curve of it. I wish I could find a mannequin with some hair. I'll be right back. Let me get a man with some hair. Hold on one second. Be right back. Now I'm better now because now I have a mannequin. I can actually act like I'm doing something opposed to just pretending. You know, because this 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 mannequin was no good. But anyway, like I was saying about the curve shits that I love, because you know I'm I'm really I'm really hard on stuff. I, I'm very forceful. So the great things about these is like. So 
said, the sharp, the sharpness of it, which is so fantastic. And that's what I love about it. And even in the front, we want to get some nice slide cut. Look how sharp that is. And you know, you don't have, and I don't sharpen my shears often. I come to the hair show every February and August, and that's when I sharpen my shears. Let's move along. Let's get, let's get some, let's get some, uh, texturizing shears. We want to do nice texture and stuff like that. You want to take out, not so all the time bulk, but you know sometimes I even cut with my texturizing shears because we want to do layers and so I give you invisible layers so it just gives you some great movement. And you know what? My mouth is dry. I need to get some lemonade or something and that's going to be my tutorial for Monika's shears. So we talked about the curved shears, and we're also about the texturizing shears. Get you your shears today. If you don't have no good shears, you can't do a good haircut. 